got some shrub sticking out. Yeah. Some mountains do more um, summer grooming. Huh. I know up north the uh, yeah. used to get so much snow. Yeah, deep the snow is here. But they didn't do the willows. In fact, the face, the place that I skied up there. I don't know if I told you, but my good friend who owned the place um, hmm. crashed his helicopter and passed away. Damn. Yeah, it's awful. What the uh, what resort? What mountain? It's just a small, like, two chairlift, one T-bar mountain called Purden, just outside Prince George. Huh. And, uh, yeah, devastating. And he, it was for sale anyway, but, so his wife and son are going to run it, you know, this year, but no snow. Damn. And then it did snow a little bit, and now it's minus 40. <laughs> so, and, you know... No, I don't think anybody's going to buy that place because hmm. it's so such uncertainty with the snow and it's not at a high elevation. Right. And it's so sad because, I mean, I skied there for five years when I was a kid when we lived there and it was just this bustling place, you know, and you didn't even think about snow not falling. Right. But they've got a real freeze-thaw cycle up there now. You know, it'll be like minus 40 and then a couple of days it's going to be minus 6. Mm -hmm. So you planning on living in Utah for a few more years or? Uh, I never know. Um, I, I don't, I don't plan on it. I don't not plan on it. Yeah. <laughs> you know. Because um, you're a good planner. <laughs> yeah, yeah, and I, I like to try to plan ahead as much as possible. Yeah. Um, but, but at the same time, I'm, you know, I'm always applying for jobs, and, and sometimes they're here, sometimes they're, you know, wherever, just random places. What are you applying for? Uh, just, just uh, some, some full-time job. Mm -hmm. That's pretty much it. I mean, obviously within my expertise. Like an audio engineer kind of thing. Um, I'm looking at audio, video, photography. Mm -hmm. Mostly, that's where most of the jobs are. Wasn't um, there one that I pointed out to you that was at PBS or, or University know. of Utah? I'm not applying for anything at the university. No, I'm not uh, No, but I mean, like I say, I'm always applying and I'm generally, it seems to be that I'm applying for a lot in central Colorado. Oh, it's not the Um, so, I mean, I just spotted one last night that I want to apply for. Um, and I, and, you know, I have, I have no medical background, but a lot of the video jobs are in like hospitals. And, and oh, doing training videos? Yeah. And I would love to do shit like that because I love, you know, I love, you know, medical stuff. And anatomy stuff and biology stuff. I just don't know anything about it. But I mean, do they say that you must have that expertise? Because that'd, no. be, that'd be a weird skill set for somebody to have your skill right. and a medical background. Um, no, no, that isn't specifically required you, most of the time. Um, it would be great money at a hospital too, right? Yeah, actually, the one I saw yesterday that I want to apply for is some uh, orthopedic surgeon in Vail. Oh, oh. Um, they, and they just need a, a video guy to video stuff. Are you going to have to show them your chairlift stuff? <laughs> oh, yeah, well. well. Seriously, they would love that they, they're, you're a skier and that you're... Well, yeah. Um, so, I mean, I'm, I'm like I said, I'm always applying and... As far as, I, I could be out of town next month for all I know. And what, <laughs> well, where, it's in Vail itself? Yeah. Oh my gosh. I would visit you. <laughs> <laughs> um, and obviously, I mean, there's no, there's no housing around except for up in, uh, it's like at least a half an hour away. So be it, that's not bad, in, half an hour? There's a town called Silverthorne on this side of the freeway. It's called Dillon on this side of the freeway. It's near Breckenridge, but Breckenridge is back a little bit. Oh my gosh. That'd be amazing. I don't think there's any housing in Breckenridge. Uh -huh. This looks so good. I wonder if that, um, yeah, it sure does. I just wonder what it turns into at the bottom there. Um, so would you be working like a regular day schedule or is it? Oh, uh, probably. But, but I mean, I, like I say, it's, it's totally hypothetical. I mean, I, I apply for jobs all the time. And I'm usually good for one interview per year. <laughs> you know, that's a, and that's as far as it gets. And are they all in ski places? Uh, 
just yeah, generally. Yeah, um, I would do a video thing of you skiing and you'd be all upbeat. And I mean, I've got I've got videos to, to share. You know, I'll tell but one of yourself too, saying this would be my dream job. I'm Brian Albert. <laughs> If I can make your videos safe. I'll let you be the guide, provided you're not getting in something. Is there a map up here? Pardon me? Is there a map up here? It looks like it. It doesn't look like it. it. Looks like into a pickle, huh? Uh, maybe. Let's go straight. 